toilet clogs seem to happen at the most inopportune moments. Fortunately, you can clear most clogs yourself without having to pay a plumber. Most clogs can be cleared with a good plunger or homemade drain cleaner made with hot water, baking soda and vinegar. For deeper clogs, try snaking the drain or using a wet dry vacuum to do the job. Keep the toilet from overflowing. If your toilet doesn't flush properly after one flush, don't flush again. This will cause more water to be pumped into the toilet bowl. Instead, take the lid off of the toilet tank and close the toilet flapper. Prep the bathroom. In case splashing occurs, place newspapers or paper towels on the floor to soak up liquid. The paper will make for easier cleanup later. You should also turn on the ventilation fan or open a window to minimize foul odors. See if you can clear the obstruction. If you can see the cause of the clog, reach in and remove it from the toilet if possible. If you can't clear it with your hands, but you know there's an object, such as a child's toy, causing the clog, skip the plunging and go straight to another method. If this is a commercial setting, speed is of the essence as a prankster may have deliberately plugged it. First, find some way to prevent embarrassment, your work uniform will help a bit especially if this is in the washroom of the opposite genders. Mop up, then just turn a large garbage bag inside out and reach as far as possible down the hole as possible and pull out the items that are clogging it and dispose of them, make sure the toilet's okay, and get out before a customer needs to use it. Use a high quality plunger. It is important to use a large heavy duty rubber plunger. Either the ball-shaped type or one with a fold-out rubber flange on the bottom which forms a seal. Do not use the small cheap suction cup type of plunger. These will often not work. Insert the plunger into the bowl. Make sure the plunger completely covers the hole. The plunger should be submerged in water to be effective. It is important to be pushing and pulling with water, not air. Add water from the sink to the bowl if necessary. Flush the toilet to check the drainage. If the plunging eventually drains the bowl, but the clog is still blocking the free flow down the drain, leave the plunger in the bowl and fill the bowl with water again. Fill it to the point that is normally after a regular flush, then plunge again. Stubborn clogs might require you to do this a number of times. Purchase an enzyme waste removal product. Look for a product that contains a mixture of enzymes that liquefy waste materials. These enzymes are used in septic systems to break down waste. Enzyme waste removal is preferable to using a drain clearing chemical because it will not harm your pipes or the environment. This method will only work on organic waste, not toys or other objects. Follow the instructions on the container. Pour the recommended amount of the enzyme product into the toilet bowl. You will typically be instructed to wait overnight for the enzymes to go to work on the clog. The toilet should drain once the clog has cleared. Heat half a gallon of water. If a toilet tends to clog easily as the result of trying to flush too much waste, using a combination of hot water, baking soda and vinegar will often do the job as well as a commercial drain cleaner. Boil half a gallon of water. Then let it cool for a moment while you add other ingredients to the toilet bowl. Pour 1 cup baking soda and 2 cups vinegar into the toilet. The baking soda and vinegar create a chemical process that help to dissolve clogs. Distilled white vinegar is commonly used, but any type of vinegar will work. The mixture will fizz a great deal. This method isn't likely to work for clogs caused by a hard obstruction, such as a toy. Pour the hot water into the bowl. Pour it from waist level, rather than right near the rim. The force of the water falling into the bowl can help to clear the clog. Let the mixture stand overnight. In the morning, the water should have drained. This homemade drain cleaner should successfully clear clogs caused by organic material. If the water won't flush on your second try, you may have hard obstruction causing the clog. Try using a wire coat hanger or a drain snake. 
purchase or borrow a plumbing snake. A plumbing snake, also sometimes called a flexible cleaning tool or auger, is a flexible coil of wire that can snake through the curves of a drain and get deeper than a wire can. The best snake is a closed auger which is designed specifically to clear toilet clogs without damaging or staining the bowl. A plumber would likely use a closet auger. Insert one end of the snake into the drain. Push down, feeding the snake further into the drain until you feel an obstruction. Twist and push the snake through the obstruction. The goal is to break up the obstruction into smaller pieces that can move through the pipes. It may take a few minutes of maneuvering to clear the obstruction. Once the water drains, flush to toilet to see whether it drains as quickly as normal. Snake in reverse. It may become necessary to remove the toilet and run the snake through in the opposite direction. This is especially true with hard obstructions that may have been flushed by a curious child. If a hard obstruction is known, and you are not comfortable removing and replacing the toilet, contact a plumber. Unravel and straighten a wire coat hanger. Then wrap the end of the wire with a rag. Use duct tape to keep the rag in place. This will prevent the sharp end from damaging the porcelain in your toilet. The wire hanger method will generally work if there is an obstruction in the first few inches of the drain. Stick the wrapped end of the wire into the drain. Once the wire is in the drain, twist it, push it, and maneuver it in a circular motion to clear the drain. If you can feel the obstruction, push against it. Keep going until the water begins to drain. Make sure you're wearing rubber gloves as you do this. Flush the toilet once the water has drained. The obstruction and dirty water should now be able to flow through the drain like normal. If the toilet is still slow to drain, the obstruction may have gotten pushed further back, out of reach of the hanger. In this case you'll need to use a plumbing snake to clear it. Purchase a chemical drain cleaner. They're available at most grocery, hardware, and big box stores. Use this method only as a last resort. The chemicals used in drain cleaners are toxic to people and pets, corrosive to pipes. Also, chlorinated drain cleaner are very damaging to the environment. Pour the specified amount into the toilet. Be sure you follow the manufacturer's instructions. Keep the lid down to prevent toxic fumes from filling your bathroom. Make sure the bathroom is well ventilated so you won't inhale the chemicals. Buy or borrow a wet-dry vacuum. If you have tried plunging and snaking to no avail, consider using a wet-dry vacuum. Do not use an ordinary vacuum cleaner it must be the wet-dry variety that can cope with water. Empty the water out of the bowl using the vacuum. The bowl must be free of water and any other debris in order to vacuum out the obstruction. Place the end of the vacuum hose into the drain. Push it into the toilet bowl a few inches into the hole. Use just a flexible hose, rather than an attachment. Coil an old towel around the hole to create a seal around the drain. Turn on the vacuum. Use one hand to put pressure on the towels to create a good seal. Wait a moment or two for the vacuum to work. There's a good chance the vacuum can suck out the clog.